Good morning, everybody. It is exactly one week since the New York City Marathon, and I am really just like itching to get back out there and start running. Um, the plan was to do a little bit of bike riding this weekend, but uh, I don't know, I just can't resist going out for a run. So it's going to be a very easy run. Um, certainly don't want to push it too hard coming back from a marathon. But like I said, I'm just starting to see some of my running buddies and, and everything, uh, you know, get back out there and go for a jog. So we're going to give it a try. We'll see how we feel. It's going to be short. It's going to be easy, but we're going to get back out there. And I am very excited to do that. Anybody who's new to the channel, check out the New York City Marathon vlog that I posted just a week ago. I hope you enjoy that and, you know, consider subscribing down below. We're going to jump right back into another training block very soon. Now that everything's back, I'm ready to go. So definitely enjoy today. We may even go for a hike later with Megan. I'm going to probably get into the gym. So let's get to all that right now. So the plan for today is to run entirely by feel. Not even gonna look at the watch. We're just gonna go out and make sure it feels easy, make sure my breathing is relaxed, make sure the legs aren't tired, and just enjoy the run. That's what it's all about today. We're gonna have a really nice view, just about a mile in, so that's why I wanted to go for a run here today. Now, I had an idea to make things a little bit fun, I have this New York Roadrunners bright orange bracelet that they gave to everybody for the marathon and you needed it to get into the expo and then to get into the actual corrals on the day of the marathon last week. It's one of those things where I know I'm not going to keep it on forever, but I haven't taken it off yet. So what we'll do, it's on my left wrist with my watch, first person to notice when I cut it off and it's no longer there in a video in the future, we'll win some sort of prize. So you have to stay tuned and see when it comes off. And the first person to comment that it came off in that video will get some kind of gift card to somewhere. But I figured we'd have some fun with it. So this is it, the bright orange bracelet. See if you can figure out when it comes off. Keep an eye out for it. Is this not a really beautiful way to start the day? Come on, this is amazing. 45 degrees, a nice cool morning, getting back to running again. All right.
I'm definitely loosening up a little bit. I've actually been getting a little quicker. Still easy during this run, but my heart rate's actually going down a little bit. Good run today. We're almost done. And uh, we'll talk about what's next today. All right, it was three and a half miles, 37 minutes, four seconds total running today. So not too bad. Nice and easy, like I said, on the way out. Um, I'll break it down some more later once we get back inside, but I'm going to take a quick trip and just stop at the gym before we go home and uh, meet up with Megan and see if we want to go out for a hike today. So let's get to the gym. I think sometimes when things don't turn out the way we want it to, it actually is a good thing. You know, if I hit my goal with the New York City Marathon this year, just coming back from not being as motivated in 2020, I might have settled a little bit. You know, even though I'm not, it wouldn't have been a PR, it just would have been a goal that I reached for this year. But now that it didn't work out the way I wanted it to, I'm hungry. Like, I'm ready to go, I'm fired up, I'm ready to train more, I'm excited for all the next races ahead, and you know, it's a good thing. And we keep going from here. So we did pick up Megan back at home. Um, we actually didn't go out for a hike today. We just came out here into the Main Street area on, of Beacon. So we've just been walking around, exploring a couple of different shops, got some bagels for breakfast. Um, and we've just been hanging out. We're out here at the waterfront now. So for the most part, that's everything for today. We'll probably just relax uh, once we get home later and order some dinner. So we'll close out the vlog here. But again, leave a like if you got this far into the video. I'd really appreciate it. And I hope to see you in the next one.